He was big and bent and gray and old And I looked at him and my blood ran cold And I said, my name is Sue How do you do? <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back. Glad to have you with us for another Johnny Cash video. This is our third Johnny Cash track that we're going to be doing. It and is. it's a boy named Sue, which is a recommendation from those comments that are always great. We always appreciate. And uh, the last one that we did from Johnny was a little more heartfelt yes. in hurts. Um, more of a heavy hitter. Hit me pretty hard. If you haven't seen that, you should probably go check it out. I'm not one to uh, show my emotions often. And they came out a little bit in that one yeah. so uh it was, sad, though. it was and you know it's it's one of those things where you know as the song progressed he got to experience and feel what he was himself was experiencing yeah. I feel more like the visuals were 100 100 percent. yeah i still you know that one part where he's kind of himself he's like breaking down crying in that little visual it's like oh man like jab you right in the heart and um so it was a great great song though an oh, yeah. amazing song uh should have won every single award i've you know that was available that year that it came out yeah um but so you guys had told us actually as well um that uh, johnny had experienced uh, some hardship growing up um obviously we talked a little bit about the drugs alcohol but also he had his brother had some kind of accident when he was really young his older brother and ended up um dying from it i think he had like it was like a saw or something like that and oh, he ended wow. up and he ended up passing away so um i don't know if maybe that contributed to the song hurt and his pain that he felt throughout his life anyways that was from hurt so that was our experience recapping that like i said if you haven't seen it make sure you check out check that out after this one a boy named sue I think it's just about a boy named Sue. <laughs> I was like, it's kind of strange because usually a boy isn't named Sue. Yeah, so so you're just interested to see where this goes. Yeah, I think the it's about Johnny talking about a boy that's named Sue and he's not too happy about it. It's the gist of it. So don't really know Fair. anything more than that. Um, but uh, you ready to check yeah. out Jenny, Ca Jenny Cash? Yes, yeah. All right, let's do it. Well, my daddy left home when I was three and he didn't leave much to Ma and me. Just this old guitar and an empty bottle of booze. Now, I don't blame him because he run and hid, but the meanest thing that he ever did was before he left, he went and named me Sue. Well, he must have thought that it was quite a joke and it got a lot of laughs from lots of folks. It seems I had to fight my whole life through. Some gal would giggle and I'd get red And some guy'd laugh and I'd bust his head I'll tell you, life ain't easy for a boy named Sue <laughs> Well, I grew up quick and I grew up mean My fist got hard, my wits got keen Roamed from town to town to hide my shame But I made me a vow to the moon and stars I'd search the honky tonks and bars And kill that man that give me that awful name <laughs> Well, it was Gatlinburg in mid-July And I'd just hit town and my throat was dry I thought I'd stop and have myself a brew At an old saloon on a street of mud There at a table dealing stud Sat the dirty mangy dog that named me Sue Well, I knew that snake was my own sweet dad From a worn-out picture that my mother had had And I knew that scar on his cheek and his evil eye he was big and bent and gray and old And I looked at him and my blood ran cold And I said, my name is Sue How do you do? <laughs> now you gonna die Yeah, that's what I told him <laughs> Johnny, is this Johnny the Rapper? Yeah, seriously <laughs> Johnny Cash is up in the bars, I love it I love so the funny. bars that he's coming with here. He's, he's doing like such a great story uh, storytelling with this. Yeah, oh, yeah like envisioning for sure. him just like stomping into this bar. And I like his use of vocabulary, like mangy. I, mean, I know I was, I was making a half-hearted joke about the bars and he's spitting bars and he's rapping, but but I really like his his use of uh, like the vernacular and the vocabulary that he has of. I think this is actually a song as well that he's written. He wrote mm -hmm. this song, right? Because the first one, they made a Ring of Fire, he didn't write that one. Yeah, yeah. Second one, it was um, the Nine Inch Nails cover. 
away from her. And this one, I think he's written this one. So it's cool to hear this from him because he's, like I said, I like the, he's got some nice like little phrases in there that he throws in, which are very unique. This sounds know? very different to me, like the style of the song than the other two that we did. Oh, yeah, but that yeah. makes sense because they weren't his songs, right? Yeah. He was just putting his own flair on and previously done song yeah and uh i, I love this it's, it's great it's so creative and it's uh it's a great vibe like it says storytelling and my name is sue how do you do <laughs> and uh it's it's you know it's just like a little headbanger you know yeah. what i mean that's it's cool it's funny i like it yeah that's what i told him well i hit him hard right between the eyes and he went down but to my surprise Come up with a knife and cut off a piece of my ear. <laughs> but I busted a chair right across his teeth and we crashed through the wall and into the street, kicking and a gouging in the mud and the blood and the beer. <laughs> I tell you, I fought tougher men, but I really can't remember when. He kicked like a mule and he bit like a crocodile. I heard him laugh and then I heard him cuss and he went for his gun and I pulled mine first. He stood there looking at me. And I saw him smile, and he said, son, this world is rough, and if a man's going to make it, he's got to be tough, and I know I wouldn't be there to help you along. So I give you that name, and I said goodbye, I knew you'd have to get tough or die, and it's that name that helped to make you strong. Yeah. He said, now you just fought one hell of a fight, and I know you hate me, and you got the right to kill me now and I wouldn't blame you if you do but you ought to thank me before I die for the gravel in your guts and the spit in your eye cause I'm the son of a bitch that named you Sue <laughs> yeah well, what could I do what could I do I got all choked up and I threw down my gun called him a paw and he called me a son and I come away with a different point of view and I think about him now and then Every time I try and every time I win And if I ever have a son I think I'm gonna name him Bill or George, any damn thing But Sue, I'm gonna name this man That was, was funny, great. yeah, was I like that it was, it was almost like a little comedy skit in a song. Yeah, it was uh, It was great. I, I thoroughly enjoyed that. Was not expecting that at all. And such a huge shift from the last song that we did Oh, I know, him. yeah. But it's refreshing because, you know, mm-hmm. you get to see this other creative and fun side of him and, and him as an artist that he did have, obviously, you know, this is, like I said, obvious that he his whole life wasn't bad. But, yeah. you know, coming off that back end, you're thinking, you know, the perception is this guy had a really hard life, and uh, that's probably the case. But this is an example of how, you know, through his music and, you know, storytelling ability that he had, was able to have some fun and have yeah. a great time, too. So that's yeah. really nice to see on the back end of that last one. I also like that they almost, like, put bits of, like, the audience laughing in it um, yeah. you know at some of his like punchlines yeah so I'd be curious to know if that was just like for um, like him recording this song or if maybe he had performed this like yeah. live at some point and they brought that into it yeah I mean it, like I think he had done a lot of songs um, live and like when I was looking through for to find the link for this song there was like a lot of videos that came up of him performing songs live mm-hmm. and that was like the most popular version available so um, I'm sure he did perform this live at yeah. some point. Uh, and if you guys have any recommendations yeah. for something that we should check out from him live, we, we would love to do that. Because I could be wrong, um, but I thought he like, performed at the Grand Ole Opry and stuff like quite a bit. Okay. But I, I just had like read that before I heard that. Mm. I've never like seen him perform cool. there. Well, you guys can leave us some recommendations. If you liked our reaction, let us know and uh, hit that like button and leave us a comment. And let, let us know what your thoughts are, any information we should know about this track in particular or about Johnny that we've discussed in the video and you want to highlight a little bit more, we'd love to hear from you. And uh, if you want to subscribe, and come along for this journey that we're on we'd love to have you i'm sure we got something on the channel you like and we've got lots of diversity coming so good reason to stick around all right that's it from us today we'll be back soon thanks for watching guys see you in the next one